Well, hello, and welcome back to another exciting edition of Coffee with Stephen. So, this week's blog, once again, is not about Justice Kavanaugh. This week's blog is going to be about the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals decision in Young versus Hawaii, and this one is a biggie. So, kind of give you a little bit of a background. In Hawaii, there is a statutory scheme where the only way that you can legally carry a firearm outside of your home is to either have an open carry permit or alternatively a concealed carry permit. Now as a matter of policy, the sheriffs in the counties in Hawaii do not issue open carry permits and extraordinarily in a rare circumstances will they issue a concealed carry permit. A gentleman by the name of Young applied for an open carry as well as concealed carry permit. He was denied, he actually did it twice. He ended up suing and it made its way up to the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. Now, when it reached the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals, the question was specifically whether or not he had a constitutional right to open carry outside of his home. Um, he got a three judge panel and one of the justices on the three judge panel was Judge o Justice O'Scanlan. And some of you may remember the name of Justice O'Scanlan. He was the original writer of the Peruta One decision, the one where he said that there is gotta be some sort of methodology for somebody to achieve a concealed weapons permit. He was subsequently overturned at, on an en banc ruling. In this particular case, Justice O'Scanlan said something extraordinarily important. He said that the Second Amendment within the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals jurisdiction the Second Amendment not only protects an individual's right to keep in their arms inside of their home, but that it also extends outside of your home. That there is a recognized right to bear arms outside of your residence. This is a huge deal. Now in California, where obviously most of the people reading or watching this are gonna be paying attention to, um, California has a general statutory prohibition towards the open carrying of a firearm. They do not necessarily have the same statutory prohibition towards concealed carry. This arguably may be a backwards way of getting concealed weapons permits issued in non-permissive counties. We're gonna to have to wait and see. Uh, there is some pending litigation based now on the case of Young versus Hawaii. Um, now a lot of people, including a couple of uh, judges that I'm in frequent contact with, immediately said, well, it's gonna get reviewed on Bach, which is very similar to what happened in the original Peruta decision. The decision came out, three judge panels you know, said that you have a, 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 a right to, uh, CC, to a CCW. The uh, on Bach review board said, no, you don't, it's a privilege. Um, so it is not inconceivable that a three judge panel might be overturned by the Ninth Circuit and Bach. I am not 100% sure that that's gonna take place. And my reasoning on this, if Young versus uh, Hawaii is overturned on an en banc ruling, it's inevitable that Young is going to appeal this to the Supreme Court, a Supreme Court that hopefully will have Justice Kavanaugh now sitting on it. If this ruling is ruled upon by the Supremes in the way that we hope that it is, it can create a nationwide standard where the Supremes have essentially said the Second Amendment applies outside the home. Um, a lot of antis are very nervous about something like that taking place. So it's not inconceivable that the Ninth might essentially say, okay, fine, we're done, and not move this forward. In any event, it's, uh, I, I hope you read the blog this week. Um, I think it's an important one. Um, it's gonna fuel some litigation that we're gonna be participating in ourselves in the law offices of Lieberman and Terramina. Um, so take a look at it. If you have any questions, always feel free to email me at artemishq.com. Um, and as always, train constantly, train consistently, train with purpose, and above all else, stay safe. Until next week, thank you for watching.